pro and anti-Trump demonstrators clashed on campus. Reporter Kiolani Sarmiento has more on the story. Say it loud, say it clear, immigrants are welcome here. The CSUN Young Democrats were demonstrating against President Trump's policies on Muslims and illegal immigrants. Even the dogs were protesting. Protester Catherine Salazar says her family deals with immigration fears every day. You have people being deported left and right every single day. My mom doesn't even want to go outside of the house. She doesn't even want to go to school. Well, go learn English. Well, guess what? If I go to school, I might just get deported too. If I go anywhere, if I go to work. However, not everyone agreed with the protests. We are building the wall. The rule of law is coming back to the United States. We cannot stop it. Trump supporters were in attendance to argue their opinion and defend his policies. So you are correct in that, okay. but you're That's ignoring the fact that there's other issues. Hey, how do you know that? That's yeah, not true. Actually, it's, hey, think about where your parents came from. Oh, really? I think he's a patriot. I don't think what they're making him out to be is, is true, a tyrant, an authoritarian, a bigot, or anything. Um, and so I'm just here to stand with Trump. And also, a lot of the issues that are being brought up uh, through the California Freedom Project, I want to let people know that um, they are wrong on some of these issues. We want a leader, not a creepy leader. CSUN student Maya Wax compares Donald Trump to Adolf Hitler. Hitler was elected um, democratically as chancellor of Germany, um, promising to make Germany great again, to get the rest of the world to respect Germany. It's very, there's a lot of parallels, and um, he was a racist, he believed in eugenics, and he tried to eliminate the entire um, Jewish people, as well as many other people who he saw as imperfect. These are all groups that Donald Trump targets. Some students wanted to cool things down with a little yoga. More than 150 people attended the Donald Trump protest. In Northridge, I'm Kialani Sarmiento.